Fair to the Cross is uh, it's great. It's a well-run tournament. Um, kids are having a lot of fun. Everything's going smoothly. We're getting a bunch of games against teams we don't usually play. Um, and the venue, the venue is great. So it's uh, couldn't be happier. You know what better place than than having a tournament in the mountains? To have a, a tournament like this in Stowe is a is a huge, a great success. Just the people, well organized, well run tournament, great competition. Met a lot of good families, so uh, couldn't wait to get back. You have people from all over the East Coast in for the weekend, and uh, I can imagine they're going to come back in the ski season too. It's it's just a fun thing to do with the kids. Stowe is a beautiful place. This is a great location for a tournament. We this is our first time up here as a family, and, and uh, last year we were in Pennsylvania. We'd love to come back here every year. We love uh, the name Better for sure. Very respectful. We uh, we love uh, what they're doing here with this tournament. Okay. Events going great. Everybody's loving it. Weather's perfect, and you can't beat the fans from all over the place. You got them coming from about 20 states, which is awesome. It's, it's great to have Bitter Lacrosse put together a great tournament here in Stowe, Vermont. Uh, a lot of families, a lot of teams. Uh, it's great to uh, meet families from other states and, and part participate in such a great tournament. Yeah, absolutely. It's amazing how many people are here. It's uh, trying to go out to dinner last night. So couldn't get in anywhere. But. Busy. I know, I know Busy. What I want These guys have been stringing all day. Every, uh, you can see we got every color under the sun, every color a kid could want. So. Lacrosse currently is an extremely fast-growing sport. I think the the, um, the fundamentals of the sport, the culture of the sport, it's certainly an old, old, old game. Uh, it is one of the original sports here in North America, and it's just in the last probably five to six years throughout all of North America has grown tremendously. Uh, we love lacrosse, and the Bitters run a great tournament, and we have five teams that are here, and we're just psyched to roll it out tomorrow and rip it and rip it. It's uh, definitely, I mean, we've been sold out since uh, probably as soon as the tournament was, uh, was announced, uh, which was probably eight months ago, and the people said today as they were coming into Stowe that they couldn't even get off the interstate because the traffic was so bad, so yeah, town is definitely bustling with uh, lacrosse players. And, uh, it's a great thing. It's a good weekend. We are so busy because of the bitter lacrosse tournament. We thank you very much and, and thank you for all your support and I hope you keep on coming back. I think that a town that would not accept the bitter lacrosse is absolutely crazy. Um, it's a fun, exciting sport uh, and it's just doing so much for, for our town in general. It's second year running. It's double in size. There's a lot of people, there's great energy, and we've seen a lot of people come through the store um, renting bikes and shopping. So we're really excited to have this event in town this weekend. Bitter Lacrosse has been unbelievable for the community of Stowe. Every single hotel will be booked, every single restaurant will be busy, busy, busy. And can we just thank you for enwrapping our community with all of these wonderful guests. We love the Lacrosse Festival. The Bitter Lacrosse Tournament last year uh, was a great event for this community uh, and this year's is bigger and better uh, and has already started to be a fantastic weekend for us. Bitter Lacrosse is bringing a significant event to the town of Stowe this weekend which is going to fill most of the beds and a lot of restaurant seats as well. A critical event which helps sustain the economy in, these, in a community such as ours. Bitter Lacrosse is awesome! When you play it up in the mountains, it's like nowhere else. I'm sorry, nobody can argue with me that you can play it in a better place than up here with it's this kind of weather in the mountains all around you. It's unbelievable. And I think we're going to be doing a lot more of these types of tournaments in the future.